are waking from your night's sleep by a runner from the war chief. Black Hand's daughter Griselda has run off with the outlaw Tudox batch of ogres. Our wolf riders have tracked them to the dungeons hidden beneath the dead mines. Find Tudox's band of rebellious pigs and kill them all, including Griselda. She must not disobey the commands of her father ever again. Alright, welcome back to Gaming Before You're Born. That's what I'm up to. I actually played through this mission just to make sure I don't screw it up several times in a row because oh, I gotta get used to these controls again. Um, because they really don't mess around. Uh, they just... This game is just hard as nails to me. Um, let's see... Like, I don't know. It's so hard to control people. And I feel kind of bad about it, but I did find a very cheap and easily exploitable strategy for dealing with this mission. Which you will see demonstrated momentarily. There we go. Alright, come back here. And then terrible things happen. Okay. And we just keep baiting people like so. Oops, get away. Get over here. And then, yeah, I guess... You know, it's funny playing this... You know, this is kind of like one of Blizzard's traditional... You know, there's been one of these in almost every one of their uh, real-time strategy games. These kind of, like, installation set piece missions and uh you know I feel like the ones in the newer games are really easy like really easy um it's almost you would have to go out of your way to fail it seems to me but uh yeah this one no this one is hard um and what I really wish like what really disappointed me is I have these necromancers. I thought maybe I'd be able to, like, you know, make skeletons out of the ogres once I'd killed them. No, not so much. They just disappear. And, uh... I can't even, uh... <laughs> oh, I love how effective that is. I can't even use a, a skeleton spell on, like, the corpses that are just, like, in the environment. Which also really let me down. But, I mean, uh, get out of there. It's an old game, what do you expect? You know? You do what you can. Right. He's getting a little long in the tooth. Let's send him out. We'll just do the best we can, which, uh,. We'll see how, how good that actually is. The first time I played this, I only lost, uh, I lost two guys. I only remember because once they died, I could use their skeletons. And, alright. Let's reposition. It is a handy formation. Gets the job done. Alright, we'll send him out. Explore. Can you not get through that? Yeah, there he goes. Ah, uh, pathfinding in these old games. It's so bad. I have not been playing very many retro games lately. I found myself. Ooh, got ahead of the curve this time. I found myself totally and hopelessly lost in um, both Season 5 of Diablo and The Witness. Really love what they've done with Diablo since it released. I mean, it was such a disappointment at first, and now it's actually a really good game. Um, you know, there were a lot of games like... What is it? Um, Grim Dawn was one that I was really looking forward to because I love Titan Quest. And, you know, Diablo 3 kept getting delayed and delayed and delayed and delayed. And then 
Even once it came out, there were all the issues around the, uh, what amounted to always online DRM. You know, you know, it was slightly different, but not functionally. You're always online. It's basically an always online DRM scheme. And then, what's the other one? Torchlight 2 was the other one that was kind of like, Oh, Diablo's not working for you? Well, play this instead. And I gotta admit, at the end of the day, now, after all this time, well, Grim Dawn finally just really actually finished. It took them forever to actually spin up production on that game. I guess it was always just a few people working on it. Um, oh, slime. And then, you know, Torchlight 2, for whatever reason, just never grabbed me. It always felt like 2, one of these guys that did most no damage. Torchlight 2 always felt too much like, um, just a raw numbers grind. Like, it didn't feel like much of a game. I don't know. Something about it just, uh, can I get away? Something about it just didn't do it for me. And then, you know, Diablo 3 at release was really bad, but it's, I mean, it's night and day. I will say, playing Warcraft again makes me long terribly for... makes me long terribly for another uh, Warcraft strategy game. I played a little bit of World of Warcraft, when I say a little bit. I played nearly a year of World of Warcraft. Although, for most people, that probably is a little bit. Um, when it first came out, I played it to death. And then, uh... After that, not so much. Not, not, not as much. Um, I don't know, I got to 60, maxed out a few trade skills. I'm not really the kind of person who likes doing it, you know endgame content repetitively forever, so I don't. Let's see. I'm not sure how to arrange these guys. Let's go to something like this. Any which way they come at me. I'll be mostly okay. And we'll send him out. Let's see what's down here first. Might have arranged people awkwardly. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, was more damage than I would have liked. Let's, uh... Let's change the facing of my ultimate formation. Yeah, no. I don't know if I'm like literally playing this game wrong and I'm not supposed to be, um, you know, moving as awkwardly as I am, but I don't know what else to do. Controls are just, you know, doing the best I can with what I have. Alright, I'll send him out. He can probably do one more pull. <laughs> now that I'm talking about World of Warcraft, this does remind me of my days playing MMOs. I always had one guy pulling to bring the thing you were hunting back to the group. Oh, that's weird. Now that I really think about it. I'm playing Warcraft 1, like people play Warcraft, uh, Warcraft. Oh, that's weird. Anyways, I would still love a, a Warcraft 4. I don't think it'll ever happen. Uh, I don't know. I guess it's possible. I mean... 
Blizzard, they did okay with StarCraft 2. I mean, it's, I don't think it's great. But, I mean, it, it's, uh, it's serviceable, I guess. I don't, I don't really, I don't know. They got through it, I guess is the best I can say, at least in terms of the, uh, the single-player campaign, which is what I usually play games for. You know, I've never, I just never have been good at, uh, multiplayer, so I don't. Oh, no, shit, this might be a problem. Let's see if, uh... Yeah. Alright, that ended up working. Uh, I'm trying to remember if there was another guy up here. There may or, there may, or may not be. No, I think it was just the one. Yeah. I don't know if I have to kill all of them, but it's probably a good idea too. Alright, well... That being done, let's move my ultimate formation of death further up. I would try to scroll, but the, uh, the vagaries of DOSBox make the scroll speed inconsistent at best. It's easier to just right-click around the map. Alrighty. Oh, which one of you poor guys? You. You're, you're the poor guy. Oh, look at that terrible pathfinding. Absolute longest route. Oh, he's not gonna make it. I screwed up. Oh, uh, well, he made it. The other guys wouldn't have. I still really would like... I know Blizzard wouldn't do Warcraft 4 right, but I still want one. I don't know what's happened to Blizzard, but... I don't know, I just don't... I don't, uh, I don't pine for their games the way I used to. That could be a failing on my part, I don't know. Maybe I've just grown up. I like the games I like and that's it. Whoops, get out of there. Is he gonna come after me? Yeah, he's coming after me. I like the games I like, and I think that's just it now. Consequence of getting old. Alright, well let's move all of you up. And move you up. I'm not sure how many more guys there are. I'm pretty sure I'm coming up on the final area. So we'll see what we have going on. Uh, at some point I might start sending the wolf riders out to, to pull. Oh wait, is there still a... no, skeleton already rotted away. Oh well. Oh wait, I need you guys out. I'll try to raise the corpse quicker. It's off this way. You know, for having just played this, I remember surprisingly little of it. I wonder if that's another consequence of just getting older. Most likely. Yeah, he's probably gonna take one hit from an ogre. It'll just be the end of him. Although, I guess I do like some new games. Like I said, oops, hello. I'm really loving Season 5 of Diablo. Alright, get that skeleton. Get it, get it, excellent. Alright, you will be my bait. You get back in here. Get back in your spot. Alright, so my objective... Skeleton. Well, he's got the magic. Is to annoy as many ogres as I can, so that they come running straight at my wall of death. Fingers crossed. There's one. There's two. All right. Can I find another one? 
Can I piss off another ogre? Yep, there's another one. All right. Um, sure. Three, three ogres. Why not? <laughs> we'll see how this works out for me. Come on. Wow, they... Yeah. All right. Awesome. So we will move all these dudes up. Um, here's probably a good spot. Move these guys up right behind them. You, you, and you. I don't know who's left. I think it might just be the, uh, the wayward daughter that I'm going to be after now. Well, we shall find out. So if I remember correctly, she is mighty defenseless. Oh, one more ogre. Oh, he's not gonna make it. Is he gonna make it? He's not gonna make it. Nope. Alright. As soon as he's dead. Let's not even wait for him to die. Alright, can I raise him? Quickly? Yes, even in death you will serve me. Back where you're supposed to be. Any more ogres? There is an ogre. Can I find anything else? Alright, well, that happened. Oh, there. He's taking a unique route towards me. Alright, well, time to start using one of these guys. Now that I'm out. I think there's no more ogres. Oh, one more ogre. Get out of there. Get, get to, get to the line. Alrighty. Yeah, I don't know if this is, uh... I feel a little bad using a strategy like this. Like, it doesn't feel like a uh, real-time strategy game doing this, but... Maybe I'm just spoiled by uh, modern control schemes. I feel like if I weren't doing this, I would just be ham-fistedly walking everybody to death. Which is probably pretty accurate. Alright, I think that's the last thing. There's Griselda. Isn't she pretty? And that's the end. Yay! Let's go ahead and save. Feel the bones crunching beneath your feet is confirmation of your awesome victory. Lots well, good to know. I am pretty awesome. All right, and with that, I'll call that an episode. Till next time. Later.